We appreciate you coming out to help us because I'm reminded of another quote by Dr. King that the ultimate measure of a man is not where he stands in moments of comfort and convenience, but where he stands at times of challenge and controversy. Um, I want to say to uh, everybody who's tried to make um, judgments about uh, what happened on December 3rd, uh, 3rd, which was a terrible incident. It was a terrible thing, but in this moment we are united to heal. We're united as students of many races, and there are many races. That's what I love about this school. African American, uh, Hispanic, Asian, African Caribbean. Um, many languages are spoken here at South Philly. Our service project today is to create a statement of unified identity to present to our school. As a large group, we will answer the following questions. Who we are as a South Philadelphia High community? How do we want to be perceived in our community? How will we conduct ourselves to promote unity in our school? Um, never doubt that a small group of thoughtful, committed citizens can change the world. Indeed, it is the only thing that ever has. Um, Margaret Mead said that, but I think that um, the most empowering thing is what you're doing today. A small group of people, and you students can do something that us adults can never do. We can do some things together and hold each other responsible for making sure that there's enough police, that there's enough cameras. But the only thing that can change, and maybe we can learn from you, is how to work together and get beyond the idea that race and ethnicity limits a person's ability and their humanity. So. But there have been so many great things that have taken place since we've had that initial press conference. And then I said, well, where's the press talking about all these great things that are taking place in the South Philadelphia High Schools? Where's the six major television stations here today looking at this unified front that probably can do much more than a piece of public legislation or a grant from the state when we talk about unity in our community. And so with that being said, I just want to...